G'day guys, how are you? Morgo here from Vape Bomb by Nolsey. Just want to do a uh, bit of a show you guys a bit of an intro on these uh, bait bombs here. They're insane bit of gear. All right, guys, some of the advantages uh, with the bait bomb by Nolsey is first of all, it's Australian made, owned, and designed, which is which is bloody insane. So it's just super simple to use. We just put some pellets in here. You can put meat in here, chicken, whatever you use, you know. But the way you do it, it's just got this simple click on it, twist fill her up and away you go. But what it'll actually do, once you put it in your net, it'll it'll attract more of what you're after. Whether you're after yabbies, crabs, prawns, fish, it holds the bait there. When they come in, it creates a feeding frenzy. When they're chewing on this plastic, the other species in the water, they can hear what's going on. They think it's a, a massive party going on. So they all come climbing over, jumping on in. And if you're out, once you set your pots and you go out for a fish or you're having a few beers and, and you forget about them and they're sitting there for a length of time, when you come back, you don't have to worry about your bait getting raided and, and dispersing and then everything in your net leaving. Because what it's got, it's got this, we've got this gauze in here. So that gauze, as you can see, it's removable. You just stick him in, it'll hold your bait in there. It's that easy. Or you, if you've got chunks of meat, uh, sausages, whatever you can just jam it in there and it'll still hold it in there simple click of the lid so with the old school opera house nets being banned now uh, they're completely banned in victoria new south wales they you can use them in your private dams but any anywhere it's public you must use these new pyramid nets so i'll just show you these here now these are a cracker net really simple you just flick it up and there's a little there's a little hook just there which catches that. But one thing they don't have, they don't have a bag or, or anything that contain your bait with them. That's where the bait bomb bait bomb comes in real handy for that. All we do, you just unclick that lid. You just grab yourself a zip tie and feed it straight through here. One end like that, just like that. Straight into the middle of the net. that easy now you leave leave that lid in leave your lid in there so what happens is one if you're changing your bait if you're sick of using pellets and you've and your mate rocks up with his special recipe you just unclick it out of here like this boom fill her up with whatever you're using straight in that easy i use these pellets here just get them from the local tackle shop somewhere like complete angler you know they're everywhere so you grab these, no smell, no mess, they're easy as. Three quarter fill your bait bomb, because when they go into water, after a couple of hours they swell up. Even the dog loves it. That's all we need. And it doesn't matter about the gauze if it's if you know if it's not in there properly. It doesn't matter. You know they'll pull at it and they'll muck around with it. You know they, just, they need to get a bit out of there and, and keep them entertained. Hold them in, hold them in the net. So we'll just grab our net here. I've got the lid already zip tied in. One simple click. All right, guys, we've got our bait bomb in, got our pellets in here, got this beautiful bit of water here, cracking day. It is a bit chilly, so we'll, um, we'll see how we go. But once you, once you have him all set, hold the tail end of the rope in your hand like this. Don't let it go with your net or you will not get it back out of the water unless you go for a swim. Just when you throw them in, you want to throw them in like a, make sure that they go in flat. If they go up on their, on their edge or, or flip over upside down, you're not going to catch nothing. That's it. I put a stick in here earlier just to hold me rope for when we catch a million of them. They don't drag me net in. Or a big barramundi goes in there. Time off. Happy days. Alrighty guys, it's probably been about 20 minutes. Uh, I'm going to pull the net in. I'm going to do a bit of an impatient check just to make sure you're on the money. You know, I haven't fished here before so I don't know. Uh, I don't know if they're in this part, this stretch of the water or they might be further up. So here we go. Let's see.
Alrighty guys, here we go. 20 minutes in, look at that. Bait bomb by Nolsey. It's pretty chilly, that's why these yabbies here, they're a bit, they're a bit docile, you know. They're, they're pretty slow going, because the water's freezing. But nevertheless, we've got our pellets in here. 20 minutes, three yabbies. Now there's enough there to put on a hook, throw back in here, and catch yourself a yellow belly. You know, you get yourself a cod, a yellow belly, and then all of a sudden, you're feeding the whole family, you're having a ball. Pretty guys, now if you want to get hold of some of these bait bombs, get on baitbombbynolsey.com. So get your nets out and have a go.